to my Chrissy Dolly World. And today we are taking a look at Lexi Girl from the Elvis Surprise Series 2 BTWs. We're gonna call it BTWs because it's no. <laughs> so let's get started, get right into this real quick because I'm excited for her. I really want to take a look at her. Um, it says, let's hang, let's, let's hang out. Lexi Girl, 15 surprises, fashion accessories, play and style. And then it says in other languages, warning, showing you hazard, small parts, not part, just under three years. One set, it says a Lexi Girl on the side. Hey sis! It says collect a well, and it said, shows how they're on Instagram and how they're also on YouTube. They also have Facebook, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, they have Facebook. Then we can see all the other characters in the series, Grace Skate, Aya Cherry, Goldie Twist, and Lexi Girl. I'm in between, but right where I want to be. Very sure, but straight to the point. I like it. <laughs> but yeah, um, you can see her barcode down here, but by the time this video is out, you won't be needing this, but just in case... There you go. Um, but yeah, let's get this girl girly out of the box because I'm really excited. Window package too, so I was able to see which one was perfect and this one was the best. So yeah, let's get out of the box. So I got the top opened, so we're gonna pull this out. One, get out. Oh, it's this that's holding it in. Okay. It's still stuck. What's holding you in? Oh, what? Well, that's confusing for no reason. <laughs> I thought I would have been able to do this better than Courtly Jester, but I'm no better than her. <laughs> oh, anyway, so this is everything. I know, very underwhelming. But yeah, let's just continue with stuff on the side. It's a tiny stand, I love it. I love it. It's a tiny stand. And I'm not being careful. And I'm not being careful over here because what's the point? I can't keep this. Why would I want to try to keep this when I can't even keep it? But it is cute. Like it has some cute details. Like um, we can see the other tweens. We can see her little sister. Some stuff that she can legs. We can see some bags, some shoes. We can see some her some makeup stuff, and we can see, of course, metal chick, the other Melanie Martinez inspired doll. Yes, I consider this doll Melanie Martinez inspired, and one of the reasons why I bought her was because she is very clearly Melanie Martinez inspired, and I love Melanie Martinez. So this is the first bag that I'm gonna open. It has a little backpack and it says a little surprise to BTW. And inside we get her little backpack, which is super cute. It looks like two little conjoined twin cats. That one half is purple, the other is black, which I think is super cute. Not a very functional backpack, but you never know. My brother has a backpack that's shadow that he can put stuff in his head. Anyways, <laughs> so this is her little composition notebook. It says Lexi Girl. You can see a little surprise BTW. It says Lexi Girl, this or that. Miss, she, it, she, there, she, the options were mismatch, match. She chose mismatch. The options for the next one is playful or serious. She chose playful. She chose selfies or photo bombs. She chose photo bombs. Me too, sis. Me too. <laughs> but, um, Miss Match. I prefer Match. That's the only thing. <laughs> and I like my outfits to look cohesive. Not that your outfit doesn't look cohesive. It's mismatched in the best way possible. Next bags. This one has little caboodles on it. It has a little design in the back. And inside, we get... What's in here? It's literally nothing. Her comb. I think 
think this could have gotten it included in another bag, but okay, whatever. Literally, there was like nothing in there. It felt like nothing. This feels like it has more stuff in here, so. Oh yeah, it had a beep and boutique stuff on it. Tissue paper, I miss tissue paper. I miss the good old days with tissue paper days. Um, very complicated the way they wrap this for no reason. I was about to say, all that wrapping paper for nothing. But seriously, that's a lot of wrapping paper for like just a bracelet, a bracelet, and two earrings. Like, what happened? And um, these earring molds are reused. They are from the the 2021 collector doll, which I do have. I review. Um, I have a review on my channel if you would like to go check that out. Cause um, you know. But right after this video, of course, cause um. We have Lexi Girl. Um, the rest should be easy. Rubber bands! I'm so excited! Come on. Come on, rubber bands. Work with me. Okay, it was one of those where they were connected. Okay. So here's the pole. It's, it's very nice. It's like a mint green, which I like. It will look nice with my concept for the way I display my OMGs. The way I display my OMGs is basically I'll have them their stands in the color of the of the colors of the rainbow. So basically, she'll be in between. Um, she'll be in between Camp Cutie. She'll be in between Camp Cutie and um, well, Uptown Girl. <laughs> um, she has two clips that are almost exactly the same size. I was expecting it to be a little thinner, but you never know. Not that I'm saying that um, OMGs have to be thin, but like, I was expecting them to be thinner and less thick, because usually like OMGs like to go for the out. The elbows like to go for the hourglass look, you know? This part's very easy, but I'm trying to save the rubber band, so it might take a, look, a good second. Okay, we have more rubber bands. I'm very excited. I love rubber bands. We love rubber bands on this channel. Ugh, that hurt a little bit, but okay, I'm, I'm fine. Oh, rubber band. I didn't see that. Um, hurt my hand, but I'm fine. I'm fine. I'm fine. Um, oh my god, she is so stinking cute. It's so small. So small, why? She's so cute. So I'll do this one for now. I don't I don't really know the difference between them. For now, at least. <laughs> this one feels a little loose. So is this one gonna be tighter or is it gonna be more loose? Oh no, this one's tighter. We'll stick with this one. Um, come on, get on. Get on. Good job, good girl. <laughs> Oh my god, she's so small. So, um, this is really cute. She has beautiful curly pink and mint mint green hair with, of course, purple bangs. And I almost thought in the box that she did not have eyebrows like Melanie when she bleached them off. I accidentally removed them in the process. And you could also see the rooting pattern of the bangs. For those of you who are curious about the rooting pattern, ugh, the text would come off. Oh, the hair's split all the way down. That's nice. That means it should be th thickly rooted, right? It's relatively good. I'd say it's relatively good. That's, that's good. Um... Her bracelet is like a whole bunch of them. There's like a purple one, there's a pink one, there's a minty green one, and there's a black one, and there's another purple one. This will go on this wrist. There we go. We have both our bracelets, and I'll put the other one on this hand. 
bracelets are super cute. And I'll put the earrings in. Come on, get on. Work with me here. We're gonna do this off camera, this is difficult. Um, wow. Let me just say, she is just too cute. <laughs> I love her so much. She is instantly my favorite doll out of the two that I got today. I was like, oh my god. Oh my god, she's so cute. The tiny little hands. They're so cutey. <gasps> wow, this is just really, she's too cute. And there's so much detail. Oh, velvety polka dots. That's neat. And there's t two layers. That's up. Oh. Why'd you fall? You okay? You okay, Lexi? Asking your dog to shut up. No? But, oh my gosh, You're just gonna let him keep going? Too... Fine then. I'm unsubscribing. Oh my god! I'm screaming. I'm squealing! Ah! It's too cute. The bracelet has little... is white with pink and black details. She has pink nails on this hand and mint green on the other. I will not stop at touching, at holding her hands because they're weird. <laughs> He's so tiny. She has a pink boot with mint laces with silver detailing and black bottoms with mint lacing on the back. We have, and then she has the same boot on the other side, but with opposite painting like pink laces, mint boots. But we, of course, still have the black bottoms with the pink laces and the silver detail. Um, that is really cute. Um, she has a little heart in the middle of her dress. With, like little frills on the edges. It's black on one side with pink flannel on the other side with the little white stitches. It's the same thing on the dress. But, of course, we have the little frills on the bottom that are pink with black stripes and we have one little panel that is like a black sheer material with little black um um velvety like polka dots and it's the same thing on this side but it's pink um honestly giving me a bit of Draculaura vibes aside from Melly Martinez vibes I'm also getting Dracu I'm also getting Draculaura vibes which makes sense since Dracula is also getting a Melly Martinez makeover. <laughs> uh, you can tell I'm a fan of Melly Martinez, can you? Like, I use it in all my shorts all the time. I try not to, but like, I can't resist. And all her songs are so good. There's a little pink bow with little white frills. Then we have a pink strap and a little back strap, black strap right there. And in the back, you can see, um, well, not a lot, but still cute. And she has a little mint green top, which is the only bit of mint green on her outfit. Like the outfit, like the fabric outfit. Not including the socks, the, the jewelry and everything like that. Just like this. She also does have some shorts underneath that are like black with pink polka dots and little pink little frills, which is super cute. She has little socks that are black with um, stripes, and we have a white sock with mint green stripes. She is, she also has white little bows that are just rubber banded in there. I will not be taking them out because they are too cute. This doll is articulated at the head, shoulders, elbows, wrist, ooh, ooh, she fruity, <laughs> hip, and a snap of bendy. That's really impressive for such a small doll. Um, here, you can have your bag. Too cute. Wow, I really love this doll. I was not, ex I was, I knew I was gonna love every single little small detail, but I was not expecting to love her this much. Like, I am obsessed. But let's have her positioned for the thumbnail now. So in the process of doing the thumbnail, uh, I looked into her box one more time just to check if I had the little, um, little MGA sort of customer service thing. Did not get it, which I was surprised because 
most modern MGA stuff now comes with that. Like, after 2021, we always get that. Like, late 2022, we started getting that, so. I was a little bit surprised, but um, I wasn't being all like, Oh my god, I'm so upset that I didn't get that. Like, I, I could cuss. But we also got an instruction manual, which gives us full artwork of these characters, which is so cute. Like, props to the artist who did the art. A little surprise artwork. Now, final thoughts. I love this doll. Um, that yeah, that's about it. Thank you guys for watching. I love you guys so much. Bye.